guys. So, we got a big day today. We're gonna head out for a giant ice cream today. I'm gonna be doing it with Bear, Kevin, Natter, and I'm, um, it's gonna be hosted by Free Eating at Bar and G's in Los Angeles. But first, I'm gonna introduce to you Twice Toothpaste. So Twice is a whitening toothpaste. They have uh, two different kinds here. So, this is premium toothpaste with cavity predictions and sensory relief. They have one for the morning and one for nighttime. So, use these two, use it for morning, use it for nighttime, and then you'll see your teeth brighten up. So, I've been using these for like about a week now, and you can't tell the immediate difference, it's only been a week, but it does help because um, my teeth is like really, really sensitive to like cold stuff. So, I'm really happy I'm using this because we're about to have a whole bunch of ice cream. And you know, ice cream gets cold. And like I said, I get very uh, sensitive to it, so <sighs> glad I'm using this because I'm gonna need it. It's gonna be so much ice cream. It's gonna be so much sugar. Oh, I'm not ready. But anyway, check them out. Link will be in the description below. So this one, the white one you see, Early Bird Whitening and Peppermint Twice Toothpaste. And this is Twilight Peppermint with Vanilla and Lavender Twice Toothpaste. So yeah, there you go guys. Anyway, I'm gonna brush my teeth and let's get started with my day. Hey guys, so today I am outside of Barton G's in Los Angeles and they have a massive like 20 pound Oops, I've dropped my ice cream. So basically it's a huge ice cream and they hand make like this huge waffle cone And um, I'm actually gonna be joining with Natter, Kevin and Bear and we're all gonna try to take this thing down It's a 25 pound ice cream like kind of dish. It's gonna be crazy Let's go inside and check it out and I am wearing my donut jet hoodie today because you know we're eating dessert So donuts I guess but yeah, if you like this hoodie, check out the link in the description below. Anyway, ready for some ice cream for breakfast. Yeah, so we are in the kitchen right now. They are building their, the huge ice cream. You can actually come here and order with your friends. They have it on the menu, but yeah, take a look at this. Alright, so we're gonna put on the ice cream. Oh my god. Please tell me it's only that. Yeah. Okay. And this is the longest ice cream cake right here. So it's got it's like a, a, a 
the Neapolitan. Neapolitan. I, 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 my entire life, I have been calling it Napoleon ice cream. Okay, don't laugh at me. That's what I've been calling it my entire life. I can't read English. Leave me alone. Anyway, so strawberry, and then we got vanilla and chocolate, and yeah, it's coated with like this cream that you guys saw them making in the kitchen. Can I try a little bit? Oh yeah, it's kind yeah. Let me okay. try this. Oh, we're starting. Okay, here we go. Ooh. So everyone now so is creamy. almost cut with their own. Thank you so much. Sir. Wait, wait, wait. No, we get like chocolate? chocolate? We get even more chocolate? Oh my god. So we can take a bite? There you go. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. Alright. Go Look at this. Start the timer. One slice looks good. Yeah, fancy. Yeah, yeah. Okay, let's right go ahead there. and start the timer, Coast. In three, two, one, start. Start. Guys, alright, so what we are looking at is this cake has been mm. cut, dude. The ice cream cake was cut, and so this is a very, very classy challenge as we're, as we're witnessing right now. So the eaters are in. So we were, we were talking earlier about how they were going to debby up this challenge. Well, they're debby it up by slice. This is gorgeous. So as you can see, a sliver of that quarter of that cake is already done. The cake kind of, is good. We're going to have a little bit of a, of a challenge kind of guesstimating the percentage done of this thing, but how's it taste so far? It's but, amazing. It's crazy rich though. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Here we it's go. It's like fudge. Damn, I'm guessing a lot of that weight comes in the actual cake itself. <laughs> yeah. And then that base is brick. You guys are going to have to eat through that brick. Any, uh, any ideas? <laughs> <laughs> Lots of water. Can I get some napkin? We're gonna keep it classy. We're gonna get some napkins. You need to that. Mm. Just like a shovel full of sand water. Oh yeah, <laughs> the sand is graham crackers. I'm gonna put sand, it yeah, taste, taste that oh, sand. It's not a dirty drink. drink. I love graham crackers. Okay, try that. Like the cinnamon challenge. Mmm. Mmm. Mm, really good. It might yeah, actually help like really break up really the taste good. of the rest of it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The palate cleanser. Meh. <laughs> there you go. Make a great gram. <laughs> I am not good at cold food challenges. Guys, it has been so hot in California all week. And today, the day we're doing an ice cream challenge, it decided to be like cold and misty outside. Like, why? Thank you so much. Oh my god, look at their. Look at this napkin. It's folded like a. Uh, Thank you. Oh, that's like a rope. Oh my god, it's so cute. Uh, buddy. Now it's ruined. Alright guys, from left to right, we got Natter Freak Eating. We got Kevin Ross. We got Reyna. And we got Bear over there on the right. So, uh... How do you guys feel so far? Full? No, no. <laughs> Very good. Right. I feel confident about this. Okay, I'll take I kind of just want to eat it from Oh, there head. it is. <laughs> Kevin's going to oh, town. Oh, there we go. He's, already, he need, he's in need of another piece. I like that. There we go. Uh, oh, I'm already making a mess. Yep. Just put a spoon in there. Mix them as well. But. So, guys, if you are just tuning in, we are at Barton G. Yeah. And this is a dish called the Oops, I Dropped My Ice Cream. It's a $175 dessert. You can order it yourself. You can come right here yeah. and just order it. It's spin four it? foot, probably it's four feet of cinnamon sugar cone. Yeah, it's the cherry flaky. Cherry. You can hear it. That. Now you can see the bottom. There's the vanilla cake. Part of it too. It's fresh it's strawberry. You want to Chocolate three. crumble. Chocolate frosting. Oh my god. That cake inside. Or proper serving size now. I'm so bad with cold challenges. So Raina's already expressed some concern with cold challenges. We barely started. Positive attitude, <laughs> man. Come on. My teeth are so sensitive. That's the hardest part about a cold challenge. It is the teeth. Yeah, I have it's not really that cold, cold though. It's not. It's it's, it's a cake. Take more cake. After those ones. Ooh. Are you drinking coffee here? Yeah, we got coffee and water for them. Oh yeah, so the, the liquid's being down right now, just so you see them on the side. There's coffee and water. Those are the two key things we're, we're drinking today. Ooh. Inside this thing, we got we got Bear gearing up, putting a few more slices on his dessert. plate. There we go. Yep. Let's get some more. Oh, wow. Oh. You guys oh, already gone through like a mm -hmm. How do I? This is kind of difficult. Go cereal. And got cherry too. Yeah, can we give some, oh, yeah. some quick chat love to Raina's ah, sweet sweatshirt? Yeah. Is that just donuts on donuts? I like that. Yeah, it's donuts hoodie. Mm -hmm. There you go. 
This is so hard. Right. If I had to guess, I think we're already about 10% of the way done through this, through this thing. <laughs> easy, easy. You don't think so? That's, I hope it's higher. that's depressing. I'm already eating my two pounds. There you go. I'm counting my beard to eat at least a pound five. Woo! Oh, that's that. Oh, look at there that. There we go. Wait, open up the camera. Let's see what we're going to hold that. There we go. Look at that. There we go. Yes. There's range play. There we go. <laughs> All right, that's showing love to that's the really Yes. Oh, yeah, she got I like that. Yeah, I was hatching it. All right, so everyone's geared up. I want to try the comb before I get full and take myself. There we go. Woo! No, don't fall, don't fall. Oh, for God's sake. There we go. That's how there you go. All right, let's go. really good. It was like a flaky cake. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so the cone is uh, a five though. Five filo. You got 40 filo. layers? It's probably like 40 layers or something oh, like that. Oh, like crazy. Make a sandwich or something. Okay, we're five minutes in. We are five minutes into this challenge, guys. What, Coach, what would you say? How, how far along are we, percentage-wise? Oh, math, I'd math, say science, we're guys. like a fifth in. You're fifth, we're fifth in? At least, maybe We're a fifth fourth. in, and I feel like no one is slowing down. Not even close. It kind of tastes like baklava or something. We got the Avengers of the eating community right <laughs> here, guys. Well, who's who? I call Black Yes, who's who, guys? Who's who at home? Again, from left to right, we got Natter, we got Kevin, we got Raina, we got Bear. We are in the building right now. Kevin is going to take Raina out with that coach. <laughs> it's about to fall. This makes you Ooh. thirsty, though, the cone part. Oh, yeah. That's, a, that's an ice cream thing that makes you thirsty. My mouth is drying up. Salty Vaughn, welcome to the chat. How you guys doing at home? Yep, Barton G. In Los Angeles. Locations in Miami and Chicago as well, so check them out. They got a really fun Instagram. You can see it right there in the bottom third. Go check them out. <coughs> Woo! <laughs> Dark nose noises already. Yep. Oh, the cone is really good. Really clicky. Yeah, we're doing some damage. It's good, but it's kind of like slow. We're doing good some damage. real good damage here. Make fire is chewing, yeah. Pretty thirsty. Mm. Natter, what's the last challenge you did recently? Hmm. A burrito, yeah. No. I had a giant burger, milkshake, and fries when I was traveling with family in Utah. It's just for as part of a challenge. We just, we just stopped for lunch, yeah. <laughs> I think it was a burger. It was, it was an actual restaurant, it was a challenge. Oh, it was, it was a challenge or it wasn't yeah. a challenge? It was a challenge. Yeah, was, yeah it's just casual. Was Gringo the last really big thing you did? And for a, that's for a contest, yeah. I mean, like the most food or whatever. Let's bring him a bad memory, I guess. Yeah, I don't know if I'll be doing Gringo again. <laughs> I don't think we need to rehash that one. No, 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 no. It doesn't sound like I want to even dig into that story anymore. <laughs> we talked about it last night. <laughs> Kevin, how did you hurt your toe? So, guys, Kevin hobbled in the, into this challenge and he had hurt his toe, so I, don't, I want to find out how that happened. They maybe see it, maybe they don't. I don't know. Nope. They did, but, um, nope. I was hiking to the bottom and up on the Grand Canyon. Yep. And I broke my toe at some point. <gasps> Just a little bit. Uh huh. And then I came home and I said, you know what I should do is CrossFit and weightlifting. No. And then after I heard it more doing that, I said, I'm going to go do sprints. And then I heard a loud snapping noise. Oh. And here we are. Oh, <laughs> no. You Kevin Durant. I was just dumb. That's not good. I don't have to work out for a month. Now there's someone's asking in the chat, if you go to a restaurant with your family and there's a challenge, do you have to do it? I don't have to do it, but we plan to be there. Okay. So they kind of put up with my shenanigans. Okay. Actually, my father-in-law gets a kick out of it. <laughs> he kind of gets a kick out of it. A common thread you'll find with competitive eaters is we plan our entire vacations around food. Really? Not always big food, but like, I, you know, like like historical sites, culture. Yeah. Sure, so it's not always <laughs> big food, though. It's all, no, I'm saying that stuff, who cares? It's all about the food. Right, 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 right. And then you fit the other stuff in after. Because this big food challenge just kind of ruin your day. Like, if you're on vacation, you probably don't want to... No, no. That's a debate I have... Um, the wife sometimes she's like oh if you do the food challenge you're just going to be complaining all day yeah okay. not good <laughs> what's your post food challenge routine what do you guys do out like what are you gonna do today drink sleep sleep <laughs> so barry's gonna sleep 
matter what you're doing. I'm gonna check some stuff out here in this air, in the area. This okay. is Hollywood, right? Yeah, you're gonna hang yeah. around Hollywood. Yeah, I'll be like Beverly Hills. It's been a while. Yeah. It's like we're right at the border of Hollywood like, and Beverly Hills. Kevin, what are you doing? You got a business meeting after this? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Raina. I have another shoot. Well, okay. Later tonight, I will run five miles and go swimming. Okay, so that's how that's how we stay in shape. That's yeah. how we stay in shape. I like that, guys. Eat hard, play hard. That's right. <laughs> I, it's funny, I didn't know that Nazareth and Bear actually went to runs. Yeah, like actual marathons. Yeah, I didn't know that they did that. And when I got into it, and they're like, that's all we've been doing this entire time. I'm like, can't you guys tell me earlier? We can all run together. What's the longest run you've done now? <clears throat> I only did it one, five, man. Yeah, I only recently got into it. I didn't know what the thing. I you're, didn't know. You're not running with the thing? No, I did it. I really should. I, I've been calling this ice cream Napoleon ice cream my entire life. <laughs> Sheltered and bubbled and don't know anything. You mean people just, just just go somewhere for no reason? No, yeah, man, I didn't know that. So Raina just found out people run for fun. Yeah. And then she also found out it's not Napoleon ice cream. <laughs> they had the joke in the right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Very, I think it's called Yogi. We are ten minutes into this challenge, guys, and uh I'd say we're twenty five percent though. We're, uh, we're, we're about twenty five percent away. How do you guys feel though? What percentage wise are you full? I'm already sick of cake. Are you? <laughs> Eat some cone. Eat some cone. Where'd the knife go? It's on the other. I, I moved it. I'm sorry. <sighs> Barton G Creatives, is this. Would you guys recommend that a certain amount of people eat this as a perfect dish for. What would you say? 10? 10 people? Perhaps? I said 20. What's it intended for, officially? <laughs> I'd say 46. What? 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 Oh, so we're, we're, we're just warped. Four, in 46 and yeah. 46? <laughs> Forty-six and forty-four. 40. <laughs> yeah, forty-six. We're, we're worked with what normal people do. Yeah. Well, actually, <laughs> on that note, like whenever we're traveling, like, like I'll do a challenge, right? So several hours later, I ask my parent, my parents-in-law, "Are you hungry?" And they're not hungry yet. Like I'm ready to eat. Over there. <laughs> I don't understand. We just finished eating, aren't you? Like, what? He's like, "Are you full?" I was like, "No, nah, that was five hours ago." <laughs> Life of a competitive eater. Here's the inside scoop. Are the rest of your meals pretty healthy? Yes. Yeah. Very you much. just gotta you just gotta account for when you do while out, you gotta eat healthy all the other times. I used to be that way. You used to be yeah, that I way? Mean, now I eat like garbage all the time. All the time. <laughs> but you're crossfitting harder than ever though. Yeah. Why do you stop eating del taco so frequently? You gotta stop? That's a hard thing to do, man. Del taco's delicious. It's super delicious. Do have to have burritos? Half pound cheese B and G burritos? Del taco actually has my favorite fries. I love those pickles. Del Taco's crinkle cut. The damn place Ooh. is like next door to my house. So you go home and you're like avoiding all the other places. And oh yeah, yeah, they got that kind of place now though. Yeah, I, I like. Yeah, I put that in their um, Huevos Rancheros breakfast burrito. The fake meat that was pretty good. Oh yeah, their burger's good. It's a sneak sneak hit on their menu. Yeah, really? The burger, yeah. A lot of people I've never even thought to do it. Double. Yeah. 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 The, the double Del. Mm, yeah. Very good. Yeah, you would never think of the burrito place would be good burger, but I tried the burger one. I was like. Del Taco is has it, good cheeseburgers. Is it taco meat? Like a thing like no, that? No, it's actual burger meat. meat. It's like yeah. patty. But you can also tell them to sub that out now. They can put the Beyond Meat mm. crumbles in there. And then you have like a little taco burger. Love it. Yeah, Flamin' and Rickshaw, this does look like something that would feed 10 people. So, apparently it's a lot more than 10. <sighs> oh, man, we're That's about the third, maybe? I mean, I you're over, over halfway through the actual, like, cake ice cream experience. Cone, there's a lot left there. How deep How deep is that uh, sand pit go? Is that Graham Cracker all the way down? Do we have to eat the sand? I know, what? right? It's Graham. It's Graham Cracker. Well, you might as well, maybe it might make it easier if you guys The sand goes like, down to about this. It, it's oh. really thick. It's like at least an inch The and sand's half. like four pounds of food right there. That's probably, I mean, the 25 pounds has to come from somewhere. Don't make us eat the sand. <laughs> right? No. Right. Maybe we already eating some of it. Yeah, I'm just eating it for like, you know, texture. Well, at the end we'll see what we have left. <laughs> so we got Chris Farley's so yeah, I'll eat the sand. Please don't make me eat the sand. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if another piece of the cone. I'm already feeling weird from the oh, sugar. Oh. Are you feeling it? How's yeah. it feeling your body? Feels Shake it. A little bit. A little weird. Like you've had too much coffee. Is it weird or bad weird? I mean, I don't know. Probably not too bad yet. <laughs> What's the coffee doing? Is it just like warming you up a little bit? Is it? Yeah. It's the bitter. It like kind of balances the um, super sweet. Change the bitter, change the flavor a little bit. Gotcha, gotcha. 
that's like a good buffet trick if you want to eat um, gluttonously is to have a little dessert between the each plate of uh, savory food. Really? And you can keep on eating and eating forever. You know, a lot of people like that video. I made a bit. I finally made a video where I went to a buffet. Everyone was like, "Oh, so that's how you eat a lot of the buffet." There's like little nits. If you really want to get your money, it's worth. What are other tips and tricks at a buffet? Don't eat the carbs. They usually like load up on the carbs, but don't go for like a whole bunch of rice. You know, and you should just get like the meat. You want to get money, you know, eat, eat yeah, the meat. Yeah, don't go the cheap you know? stuff. Yeah. yeah. Eat the meat, and then um. That's funny that y'all shout out to Fanbot for for all those bit donations, guys. All those bit the, those bit donations are going to this uh, great little charity called Bracken's Kitchen, and they uh, Ooh, definitely help with food and security it. around. It. So you're cutting like a maniac. Oh, check oh, them out. Yeah, now they're going to screw around here. Now they're like, I gotta see Hollywood, so let's let's Jeez. cut the crap. <laughs> There's no time for all that slice. Yeah, we'll 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 People want to see that slice. We'll oh, that where, which camera did I hold up to? Where, yeah, where hold it up to the, the webcam right there. There you guys go. Jeez. That's actually kind of terrifying because there's still so much left after he does that. Yeah, <laughs> there you go. Yeah, you like all right, here we go. I don't like perspective. <laughs> I like one foot at a time and you're there. That's right. Like, like in the runs, you know? Yeah. But you think about it too hard, you're going to screw yourself. After I eat this, I'm done. Hell no. <laughs> <laughs> so you guys, we are 16 minutes in. We are 16 minutes into this challenge, y'all. And we are at Bart and G. We're eating the Oops, I Dropped My Ice Cream, which is a four foot tall ice cream cone that's laying on a sand bed of graham crackers, beautifully delivered to your table here. It's only 175 bucks, which I'm still kind of mind boggled about. That's so, that's so affordable for this whole experience When you experience take that, that price, you divide it by 46, that's more meant to feed um, people. That's a really good price. Right. Yeah, amazing. Yeah, that's like that's amazing. $2 per person. Yeah. yeah. So it's yeah, like yeah, that's crazy. would be the answer. No, it's not two, like three, four, whatever math, it's cheap. Okay, okay. I guess I have to do one seventy five. There you go. Six, I'm so seven. curious what's going to happen when you get to it's a certain like point. Three. I feel like yeah. it's going to collapse pretty soon. I mean, um, let's I guess see what I guess I want to keep that on there. Yeah. I thought there was like stuff all the way to the top of like, that. Yeah, thank thank God there's another. No, that <laughs> cap. Ooh. Ah. Well, the gist of it is just a cake. That's just a cone. We can just like take the cone off. Yeah. Why? So Ooh, that's. Well, I thought they said not to for some reason. I think it's keeping it together. Or something. Thanks for no, 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 cheering them on. Oh, just take the whole cone off. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take yeah. The whole cone off. Then it won't chip and everything. Oh. Yeah, so we can like. Oh see my god, the that looks so. It's like a cornucopia. Yeah, it looks so oh, yeah. 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 Man, that cone looks so flaky and delicious. It's really good, but it's like the it's gonna be the hardest part yeah, of this yeah. challenge. The cone. Yeah. Oh, is it? Every look, it's really hard to eat quick, and it's rich. Mm. Yeah. Oh, it's buttery. It's right? like baklava. Though. Yeah. Oh, oh is it? Like a baklava. It tastes exactly like baklava, oh. which you can't eat a lot of. Cinnamon baklava. and sugar is, is making it nice and flaky. Oh man. This is gonna need like a lot of coffee. Cherry. Yeah, Jeremy. Cherry. <laughs> Jeremy, fool. That is going to be hard, the cone. Yeah. The, the cone is going to be by far the hardest part. I want some? Yeah. I might as well. Get Ooh. the fruit in here. Ooh. Oh yeah, you're right, it is like muscle. Oh man, we're only like halfway through this actually. We're not even halfway. Only through this. Oh yeah. The dome. Yeah, they're like halfway through the cake. Oh, for fuck. Okay, yeah, so no, no. we're doing an audit of our of our ice cream situation what? right now. We're halfway through the cake. A little discouraged. Yes. I would say we're about 30% through the cone. And the cone isn't your traditional cone, guys. It's a nice little flaky and cinnamony. And uh, early murmurs are saying it kind of tastes like a baklava consistency. So, cone, yeah. yeah, the cone. So nice and flaky, multi-layered. I mean, beautiful dish to enjoy. These guys are going after it, though. Yeah, I'm <laughs> I have a lot of room, but I'm getting discouraged a little. By what? Just looking at what's left. Just looking at what's left? Yeah, but then, do you also remember that you have three other superstars next to you? Uh, true. There you go. Yeah, I, I gotta think about a, a quarter what left. Yeah. yeah. It's the beauty of a team. You know what I mean? If uh, you divide that by four, not that bad it's not that bad. Yeah, you guys are good. You guys are good. Bear, what's, what's on your mind over there, man? You're looking at it kind I'm of... Looking, I'm, I'm kind of strategizing with them as 
well. I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. What was the plan of attack? Who's going to get what? You know. So is anyone taking any part of this challenge a little easier than the others? Then maybe like you guys are like, all right, I'm keeping the ice cream. Someone getting the cone. Who's like really easy on the cone right now? I really want the cone. You can eat more. You can eat more of the cone. Yeah. Like this might be the teamwork, guys. Yeah. Because um, I'm scared of cold. You're scared of cold. Okay. So that Who's like, not afraid of cold? Maybe we we'll switch it up. Who I mean, can't the ice cream is the easiest thing to eat. This is getting wild, y'all. <laughs> getting <Yeah>. crazy. <laughs> I think I eat more ice cream. Maybe. Okay, I feel like Nader can handle the ice cream. Every time I do ice cream challenges, I just die. I don't do it. The after effects are terrible yeah. for ice cream. Bear, which part is, is, is tough for you right now? Definitely the cone. The cone? Yeah, the cone. Okay. We have third no, I can do the cone. It just takes time to shoot. Third of the way through time wise, or through yeah. the through the action? Twenty minutes uh, down. Twenty minutes wow. down, you know. Oh man, maybe an hour from. Oh. Barry, tell us a little bit about your shirt. Yeah, wearing Britney Spears on there. Yes. Okay, you, you do you wear a different pop star every time you have a every food challenge? No, I was uh, there for one. I had a uh, Kelly Kapowski. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> and then uh, last uh, previous challenge before that was uh, Whitney Houston. Whitney Houston on the previous challenge, okay. And then uh, I kicked it off with uh, Alicia Silverstone, her character from Clueless. Okay. Yeah, I'm Cher. Dang, so you, you, you go out and buy these for every last one. Yeah. So you can't do a challenge if you don't have a new one in the wardrobe. Well, it depends on if, uh, like, Britney right now, I'm trying to channel my, you know, my bitch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh you, you better work. Yeah, Yo, exactly. Bro. Better work, <laughs> bitch. It's the way I'm... <laughs> Alright, so, I'm gonna give, I'm gonna give you some, some emoji Very love for that. There you go. <laughs> That's so funny. Okay, you're gonna have Justin Bieber on there soon? He counts the pop star. Oh, I, I said ladies, man. Oh, la it's yeah, all ladies. All ladies. It's all ladies. Okay, all ladies. respect. I mean, respect. If, I, if I wore the beeps, I don't know. If you might have a on a list somewhere. <laughs> Yo, did you hear he might fight Tom Cruise? That sounds like a drunken tweet. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, who would win in a Cruise? fight? Tom Cruise would murder him. Okay, but let's say they both had six months to train. Tom Cruise would murder him. He's like very, he's like extremely athletic. Yeah, he's crazy. But also, isn't Bieber like best friends with Floyd Mayweather? Like, he probably can get some tips and tricks from Floyd. But Cruise is crazy. Like, yeah, Cruise has been training his whole life. Yeah. That's true. That's true. And if anything goes wrong, he can just run. Yeah, he's like six feet deep. Oh, is that thing still going on? No, don't do no I, I heard Bieber backed out. He said it was just a joke tweet. Once he found out that Tom Cruise would actually whoop him. We'll see. <laughs> why, why would he say that? Like, that's the first one. I have no idea. I think he was making a joke for the paparazzi. They asked him what was up, and he just challenged him to a tweet, uh, to a fight there, and then tweeted about it later. That's ridiculous. Bats thinks Tom wins yet. Okay, Bear's going in for a little bit more. I like that. Oh, Kevin. Kevin, on a scale of 1 to 10, 10 being you're going to tap out, 1 being you out. just showed up. It's just so <laughs> I just want, like, some pizza right now or something. We can get some pizza. Wait, like pizza. Maybe, that. maybe a lobster pop tart? We'll get one. We'll get one. out that they have those here, so. Yes, I'm just going to list off some of the incredible things these guys have on the menu, because their Instagram is really one to behold. You guys should definitely check them out, at Barton G on Instagram. Do it. Vegan ramen. Ooh. What ramen? Vegan ramen. They have jambalaya, lobster, and chicken pot pie. Woo! What's that dish you guys have with the uh, giant dollar bill? Dollar dollar, dollar bills, y'all. Yeah. Dollar dollar Ooh. bills, y'all. Guys, this whole menu is is absolutely incredible. So you guys have to check them out. Restaurants, gorgeous as well. And here we are, Blah. sipping a little bit of coffee, Blah. casually. Uh, eating a 25 pound ice cream cone. Oh yeah. Say it's four feet tall. Right now, guys, you guys knocked it down. It's no more than a foot tall. Can we get a refill on coffee, please? Yeah. Everybody move back with you. Um, oh, we're good. Do you want merch? I mean, I'll take yeah, merch. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. Yo, so shout out to everybody watching at home. Bats 22, Flaming Rick Shaw, Sultan Van, Fubi's fan. Thank you so much. Fan bot. Welcome, guys. And, and any uh, bid donations to cheer these eaters <coughs> on again, we will be donating <laughs> to Bracken's Kitchen, which is a great charity out in, in Orange County, and they feed a lot of the less fortunate, and they do a great job giving them really wholesome and delicious meals. Yo, shout out to the follow. I didn't see the follow right there, but I will 
find you. I see you on the screen. Uh, if you just follow chat in the chat. There you go. Oh, thank you. You're What's up, Sha one one two? That is a big ice cream cone. So if you just wow, join it in, uh, yeah, yeah. they brought it out to the table. Uh, like there you go, follow Barton G on Instagram. Like you right, shell, giant ice cream cone. Okay. So Raina just, just is tearing right. through it. This Look at this like, thing. That's a nice thing. Oh, oh there you go. I'm so tempted to walk over and get some of this food. Mm, come on. There we go. This is Raina's yours is coming. Thank, Thank you. So much. There you go. Thank you. Ow. Yep, so if I had to guess, we're, you know, we are good. We're 50% we're so through. Sir. Easy. 50%. Kevin, you don't think so? Well, we're 50%. We're 50%. Well, that's discouraging. How many double what I already did? You know, when you feel like that, you know it's, it's going to be rough. Nana, how do you feel? I feel okay. Yeah. But seeing what's left is, is yeah. a hard thing to deal with. Is that graham cracker stuff for you at the bottom? Oh, you guys don't have to eat the brick. I think I think the mm, chat wow. at home, they're like, yeah, they don't need to eat the brick. Do you guys know if the 25 pounds includes the actual brick presentation as well? Or yes, we just yes. kind of, it does, okay. So you guys, it's not even 25 pounds of what you have to eat. 20 pounds of just food. 20 oh. pounds of just food. Oh, this is good. Look at the eyes bright up. <laughs> <laughs> we are super good here, now guys. It's easy. <laughs> When you're eating sugar, the weight, oh. you should like double it. Sugar yeah. kind of messes with the food challenge capacity. Yeah, so it's not, you're not, you can't base it just on the capacity no. when, you, when you're eating sugar. Definitely mm. the type of food matters. Yeah. Like, look at him. It's making me crash. The sugar's yeah. making me feel weird. It's making me like, very tired. Someone yeah. slap Kevin. <laughs> Someone else. I've known him, I've known him too long. <laughs> That's why you should slap me. He knows things. He knows things. <laughs> Kevin is a senior competitive eater on this pound here. Senior meeting, he's been doing it longer than life. He's been doing it longer than all of us. Okay, what was your first challenge ever, do you remember, Kevin? Probably the um, pot stickers in LA. Was that at a specific restaurant? It was a contest, remember? but it was. Uh, oh, it was a contest. Oh, the yeah. Gyoza Fest. Yeah, yeah. Oh, the Gyoza Fest. 2006, I want to say. Holy cow, do you remember how many you ate? Not too many. I was 115, maybe. 115, not too many guys like yeah. work. <laughs> Did you win that challenge? No. No, not even close. That's why you said love. Well, back in the day, I guess I could get like uh, chili red and rancher cucamonga. Mm. Oh, yeah. Cool. What was the food? It was a five pound burrito. Five pound burrito was your first challenge. That's how you met Natter? Yeah. There he, you go. It, funny story is we just got doing, doing a half marathon out there in the Fontana days and he just goes, hey, you up for a food challenge? <laughs> We just got done running a half marathon, and I'm hungry. Like, well, I guess let's go. So, you know, all started. Uh, yeah, you know, positive influence. But uh, he uh, ushered me in and uh, basically said, like, this is what it's going to be like. You know, it's going to five pounds. Are you ready for this? And it's like, you know, when you get that blessing, you know, possibilities are endless. So you each did a five pound burrito on that yeah. challenge. He, made, he makes he makes himself very commanding. No, yeah, no, no. I assure you, no, like no, no, no. Like you must no. <laughs> no, it's just because it was it was it was one of those uh, situations where it was just like we just got done running and he was still up for it. And I was like, <gasps> yeah. but that's amazing. It was an amazing day because uh, he ran I think two hours and eight minutes and he just PR'd his last race. So, Thank which you. means personal record. Thank he beat his oh, longest time. I got all the public relations for your own race. That's right. That's right. That's right. Matter, what was your first challenge back in the day? It was a five pound burrito. That was the first, that was also, Not that one. but it was also no, a five yeah. pound burrito. It was at a place in Orange County called La Casa Garcia. Is that the one we we, we went back to? I think to? you guys did it. Me you guys have been there. Did you go there with you? No, no, no. I went there with co workers who, they saw I could eat a lot, but. You know, they were like, this place is a five pound burrito, you gotta try it. Yeah. And so I didn't know. Like, I kept putting it off. And one night, we're like, screw it, let's just go there and eat dinner. And I thought I was gonna die, but <laughs> I finished it. It took me forever. It, maybe, it. it felt like forever. Like an hour. Most of these stories are always like, you know, a friend told me. Oh, yeah. 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 That's how, I think, just actually, when I knew I could eat a lot, my own. It's like a one part. Friend went to all you eat sushi place. Mm. Yeah. And like, um, oh, I ate like, I don't know, like 120 pieces of sushi. And he's like, oh, you really said sugar. Weird, not normal. I was like, well, I 
I'm not selling sushi weed. <laughs> it's a good deal. That's so good. <laughs> Raina, what was your first challenge? Do you remember? I think following the trend of the burrito, it was actually a four pound burrito. Dang, is that burrito the gateway drug for competitive use? <laughs> I, think, I think it's because burrito is the most common because it's very easy just to make a big burrito. Just stack ah. up tortillas together and then boom, bigger burrito, right? Got it. And then it's cheap. You know, like food challenges is usually it's free, and then you know restaurants like food challenges they want it to be like not low cost as possible. That's true. So usually it's not that much meat; it's just a bunch of beans and rice, and it's just very cost efficient for them. It's still publicity and it's the marketing gimmick. You know, yeah. food challenge we got a five pound burrito, but it's just mostly tortilla, beans, and rice. Oh. Like, right? It's very cheap for them. Yeah. So guys, yeah, like perfect. To be clear, though, this I is not a food either. challenge. We're just eating. This go. This is just a beautiful dish that they just happen to have, and no, we we, we are a, making a challenge of it. So we're thankful that they're letting us do it. We have it. a self-imposed time limit that we're halfway through on now. So yeah, we put a self-imposed time limit that we're halfway through. We're doing one hour, but we're thirty minutes in, Costa. Yup, and beautiful. We're like like over halfway through this thing. We're over halfway through. There's no turning back now. I no. I'm pretty sure we. We're not gonna do it. We're like, we're like, yeah. feel, we all feel the sugar crush. Like yeah. I said, with sugar, the, um, we just feel the really drained the out. The cake is okay to eat still. The ice cream's making me pretty, uh, pretty sick. Uh -huh. Yeah, like it's making it it's churns every time you eat ice cream. Because even if you're not, the cake is fine, you know. Very hard. And, yeah, that's why people fail the um, the gallon milk challenge so much because it's like turns up your stomach. Yeah, even if you're not lactose intolerant, just too much cream at once, it really just kind of drains your body. Like, you know, we came here early in the morning, we're tired. We got excited to eat this, 10 minutes in after, now we're tired Also again. other excuses. Yeah, <laughs> anymore. <laughs> anymore. <laughs> Have a list. But it, it really, this kind of challenge is like the hardest type. Yeah, sugar. Sugar challenges are terrible. It's like a big pizza would be done. You think so? Alright, let's go to Big Mama for pizza now, Brother, are you down? Well, big, no, no, not Big Mama. I'm surprised I have one delivered right now. I said a pizza, not a monstrosity. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Might have to, oh, Food Beast fan, another 50 bits. I, I bet that you guys would finish it. I might have to owe 50 uh -oh. bits. Uh oh. What's your favorite challenge you've done? Well, yeah, what is your favorite challenge? I don't know. But there was one night we went to dinner with our buddies from Reckless Eating. Mm -hmm. They decided to be funny. And whatever we asked to order, they pretty much ordered five times the amount. <laughs> Bear was there. That was <laughs> so they bring out this like mountain of sushi, and Kevin and I looked at each other like, you know, we're gonna have to work to make sure we don't have to pay extra to get out of here, right? Yeah. Oh, because it was with all you can eat. Yeah. They charge you. Whatever's left on the plate, yeah. you gotta yeah. pay for it. So it comes out. It looks like you know, wall to wall of sushi on a platter. I can't believe the kitchen like agreed to make the amount that they. Yeah, I can't believe they let that much come out at a time. There was a lot of glaring. Yeah, my favorite was was the round before we ended it. He, the guy got the order and slammed it down like because <laughs> we just kept giving him. In, and he put out the plates and he kept getting back more and more oh, empty wow. plates. All you can see, she plates can be funny. They stuff comes slower and slower. Oh, They're just like staring daggers at you. Oh, wait, I remember <laughs> you saw them in the back. Yeah, the, the chefs kept handing the paper off to each yeah. other because they nobody wanted to make it. Wanted to do it. <laughs> Nobody wanted to make the order. Like, now you do it. You guys must be a nightmare when people see you coming into a... Like, oh, most yeah, people like it. It's kind of weird because like most people are cool, but sometimes people are like mad when you win. You're like, why would you have an eating challenge? It's only fun if you're so pissed off about it. Do a lot of... Uh, I heard a lot of places don't... Like, if they have an eating challenge and they know a competitive eater's coming, like, they won't let you do it. Or they won't pay you or something. They'll screw you. Huh. I'm not going to name a location, but she recently did a challenge. And it used to be half an hour. She went in there and obliterated it. Now they knocked it down to 20 and the food looks like it got more and more. Oh, wow. And it's $85 if you lose. I don't even know what this is. Oh, because you made it a dish. Oh, well, how? We, we talked about it. I think I, I yeah, 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 we talked about it. I'm not going to name the location, but they, they shaved off 10 minutes and they made the plate bigger. Oh, <laughs> yeah. You went in there and you destroyed it like in six minutes or seven minutes. I did so many, I don't even know what he's talking about. No, it's... <laughs> Because uh, oh. when I mentioned like you there, they were like, uh, "Oh," and then I just see him go. <laughs> I was like, "Oh, part of, he's part of the pack. He's part of the, he's part of the team. <laughs> Get him out of here." Yep. Yeah. So they put that on purpose. It's eighty-five dollars if you lose. Can you tell me what the food was? Okay. It's a, it's two pounds of fries, I think, and a stack of four patty burger. It's like four and a half pounds. That sounds hard. That doesn't sound hard. No, but the, the... No, I'm just kidding. That's that's not, not, there's some, hard. It's yeah. onion rings. What else is in it? Uh, slices of cheese, mozzarella stick, and uh, bacon. 
tomatoes. It's, well, it's just a smorgasbord of stuff in this burger. Smorgasbord. Oh, is it the one that you were told me you were going to? Oh, yeah. It's not yeah. Going to, oh, <laughs> yeah. Wait, I thought they were cool. It's like those buff guys, right? <laughs> Uh, the, yeah, that's the way he makes it. You know, the hot ones. <laughs> well, you know, they were. Uh, <laughs> wait, no, no, wait, wait, wait. No, no, it, it, it's near me. It's close to me. In the valley. Kevin, is that a brain freeze or a brain fart? Uh, I'm out of it. I'm having that weird conversation. Like, I don't like, like you, right you don't like me. I don't like you. You're not sure if you're brain fart. He's like, but we like each other earlier. Really <laughs> this date went bad real fast. Oh, god damn. My stomach's just moving around. Uh oh. What? What? Everyone heard that at home, guys, by the way. What's that? <laughs> oh. You did, you did it like a year ago. You, you know what's there. going on is you guys are doing all the We got Matt and Kevin doing all the They're playing 20 questions over yeah, there. Yeah, they're hanging out. <laughs> <laughs> what? what? <laughs> he told me. I don't even remember what burger it was. Well, anyway. I, so I did so many burgers oh, that I know what you're talking about. On the menu, though, it's right there on purpose. It's failure price. <laughs> That's like a mean way to do a food challenge. Like, yeah. A failure instead of just like, no, this is what the menu item costs. Mm, yeah. Because it's good. Yeah. But you do, if you do beat it, it's free. There you go. You know, well, there was. Sure. There was a giant sandwich in Vegas. They did the same thing. It was to play up the Vegas theme. If you fail, it's a twenty-five dollar sandwich. But if you fail, it's fifty dollars. Feel the challenge. Oh, so gambling. Yeah, you Whoa. are gonna gamble hey. in Vegas. Oh. I have an idea for a restaurant. Like that every time you, you pay, you can spin like a wheel, and you either get it for ha uh, free or double the price. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> like, no matter would what you order. That? <laughs> I might. That sounds fun. I would go there. <laughs> you know. That's actually a really oh, interesting concept. Oh, it comes with the root beer. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was Wait, why was he mad? Delayed. No, he wasn't mad. It's just that when you went in there and beat it, they shaved off 10 minutes. Yo, Bats 22 oh, yeah, no, is cheering you guys on, guys. Yeah, no, it's because after I went, there two more competitors either went. Oh, yeah. And it's so like they're just like, they're part of the pack. Yeah. You know, yeah. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. Okay, okay. That was a long time ago, but the place is no, nice. No, they're good. really nice. The place is really good. It's just that food challenge see. is what? merciless. Well, Kevin. Oh, Bats 22, thanks for the donation and the cheering, well, and, and we're going to tell the eaters that you guys are cheering them on. <laughs> nice so doing you go. guys. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> this is not. <laughs> really? This is, I'm joking. What? Oh. Are you good? Natter just started. Free Natter, 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 never, Natter never quits. You know what? Natter can eat forever. He's the, he's no, the Kawhi forever. Leonard. No, the not forever. Let's bring, let's, yeah, he's cutting it more. No, just put forever. the whole thing in front of you. Natter? No, yeah. we, won't, we won't do that. Carry Natter. Carry us, Natter. Yes. Be the wind beneath our wings. Kevin! How are we doing, my friend? I want to die. Yeah, me too. <laughs> I don't you really want, want to die. live. No. Oh, oh, Peace. Oh, 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 guys. Let's give it up for free. No, no. I'm still going in. There we go. go. There we go. Now you've shamed me into eating one. Me too. Is that what I always think? That's true. We do that to each other. Remember that time we ate baby food? Reckless <laughs> eating? Oh. Yeah. All right, guys. If anyone's watching, does anyone want to match? I'm gonna do a hundred bits. If I drink this one, excuse me. Kevin finishes everything on his plate. Well, I can do that. A hundred bits, but you have to do it in the next couple minutes. Let's go. If you finish it, show everyone what's left on your plate. Just a little slow. <laughs> Matter if you finish that before he does. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> a thousand. I'll put no, a thousand bits on it. Yeah. Oh. We're not we're not that no, early. No, but I have an amount of bits in my in my thing oh, right now. We're not that early into this uh, festival. I recently learned that um, that you know knock on wood? Oh the haircut two bits. bits. Oh yeah. Two bits. Twenty one minutes to go. Twenty one oh, minutes to go, sake. guys. Oh. We are Look. We are almost there. You guys drink second gear now? No. <laughs> I'm not cool. I'm just sick of sweet. Yeah, this yeah, is just, it's, it's not palatable anymore. I'm not. I'm just tasting, tasting milk now. Yeah. I don't feel full. I just feel gross and shamed. <laughs> you can do it, Kev. I can. You, know, you got bitch riding on this. You guys have people in the comments who thought this was going to be a literal cakewalk. 
Yeah. Ooh. Ah, ah. Yeah, yeah, they, they did. They, they saw it come out. They're like, okay, big, but you guys are good eaters. Some were like, yeah, four people, that should be a breeze. Yeah. And they were saying this dish is meant for four to six people. <laughs> but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say this. We came in earlier in this. We had 12 people. We got through like eight ten. of it. <laughs> so yeah, when we filmed this for our news video, which you guys yeah. can watch on Facebook, mm. uh, we brought 12 people. Is that right? And apparently they only put a dent in about 10% of it. Yeah. We made sure it didn't go to waste, but it definitely... It's for 12 people, this, nah. is good, this is a good deal. Oh, man. Following up on the um, the, the gambling concept from earlier. Yeah. I used to joke with some students. Well, I'm serious. Yeah. Like, How would you guys feel if I flipped a coin? Okay, as you pass the class, tail as you fail. How do you feel about that? Oh, 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 oh. what do they do? <laughs> some of the kids like, I'd take that bet. The ones who like borderline. Like yeah. <laughs> well, you know what's tight? You know what's tight is I would take that bet because if I if I win that bet, you have to give me an A. Right? I pass. Right. But if I fail, I'm just gonna go tell the principal the teacher was gambling. Mm. Like, uh, it's, the day, it's day one. Like how am I failing? So boom. What you know, those, those are kids who don't talk to the principal. Okay. <laughs> gotcha. Gotcha. They got that code. Okay, Kev, show on your plate, man. Let's go. get that jump. It goes all the way I already to forgot top. how much I said. What did I say? 100 or 500? 500, 500 obviously. It's for the kids. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> it's for the kids. There we go. Yeah, he beat me, Kevin. Slow poke. Yeah. So I super, I'm not enjoying this anymore. Boom. Oh. For the kids. Boom. Yes, he did, Shaw. There you go. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So, what's your craziest story of having to work after eating? Do you have any crazy stories about that? I mean, I work for myself, so I can get away with a lot. No, but like, have you ever had that conversation with someone and you're just feeling super full? Oh, yeah, well, it, you know, I make my own hours, so I just go to bed. Sometimes my boss is an asshole and makes me work anyway. Are you your boss? Yeah. There you go. I'm an asshole. Do you do anything outside of eating? <laughs> Breathing, running. Yeah, what do I do? I used to know brain kind of hurts right now. No, uh -oh. me too. <laughs> Every so often we'll have chats and it'll go on forever. Then all of a sudden it's like, you know what? I gotta go get to work. I'll talk to you later. <laughs> I'm with you. Bear, are you tapped? No, I'm just, I'm, I'm we're, we're probably falling asleep. Are you tapped? It's like, drop it. Remember what plays at a star fox? Yeah, turn into the Swedish chef. I feel like Loki, we're a science experiment. What happens yeah. when a human consumes too much sugar? Diabetes. Well, no, like within this period of time, like how much we're consuming. Also diabetes. <laughs> okay. We get the diabetes. <laughs> okay. Oh, I don't thousand know. bits? I'll match that too. Honestly. Okay, Fanbot saying a thousand bits if Bear can crush the rest of that cone. I'll throw another thousand bits. Oh, dude, bits come on, man. That's for the kids. Dude. That's for the kids. Dude. Fanbot got an upgrade. Fanbot got an upgrade. How much, um, time is My actually? god. 17 minutes. Fanbot's entire firmware is 17 <laughs> minutes. Yeah, no way. <laughs> I have to keep on eating, though, I guess. I still got 500. I love this turn into a, this turn into a race. I still got 500 on, on Natter okay. finishing his plate. Yeah, let's go Lady and the Tramp on this and just let me have Okay. <laughs> it's a great movie, by the way. It is. It's a great movie. <laughs> oh, we're gonna play, so we're going to play chicken with a kid? Yeah. <laughs> what was the first Disney movie you ever saw, Kevin? Yeah, there you go. First Disney movie? I have no idea. I remember the first R rated movie I saw. Oh, what was it? Born in East LA with Cheech. Oh. Oh, that was your first R rated? <laughs> yeah. Did you have to like beg your parents to watch R rated? That was my that was my thing. I like wanted to watch Scream, and I still know what you did last summer, and they wouldn't let me do it. My parents were sticklers for the rules. Were they? They're like, you know, alcohol is evil, and the moment you turn twenty one, let's go drinking. Go drink. Go ahead. This is sugar is too much. This is not this is not working out right now. I don't no. Think. Uh oh. Everybody's kind of like just mentally quit. If you gave me pizza or something yeah. right now, I would go to yeah, eat. Yeah, plate of pasta. No more sugar. Let's get some pasta up in here. Where, where is that thing you call the lobster, whatever, pot pie? That sounds good. They serve that here, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. I will eat that. Oh. Take it. I feel like we're being quitters, but... Uh -oh. No, no, no. No, no. Dun, dun, dun. Being a quitter is not trying at all. That's right. This is true. I, I could eat more, but not the whole... 
Yeah, what are you guys looking at? If you had to guess the percentage, you guys have a better angle on it if, than I do. If What's we just went ape, ape right now and tried to eat as much as we could until we just puked, we'd probably get through half of this, maybe. <laughs> you know? Oh. Like, it's not, it's impossible right now. Honestly, if, you, if we went ape, we could, I think we could finish it. If we you got, think? like, bowls. But it's a, and, it's a damn cone. Yeah, the cone's so really go thick. We gotta blend her out. Go ape, let them go ape. Go ape. I say ape. If this was blended for us, we could just drink it. I think we would. Fine, finish. get a blender. Let's go. Why well, you use your spoon and blend it with your with your hand? <laughs> yeah. I don't want to do that with ice cream. Fifteen too much. minutes to go. Fifteen minutes left. We're gonna sit here and chat for fifteen minutes, guys. Q and A time. <laughs> yeah, if you guys have any questions Q&A. for the eaters, go for it. Can we draft a fifth member? Uh oh. Yeah, can we add people to like still win? Did you want to eat some? Should I eat some? Yeah, yeah. come in. Come yeah. Oh. All right. Oh. If you can eat this, I'll start again. Remember that one time I goaded you into eating a two pound cupcake? I know, I went, I, didn't, I was like gonna watch him eat cupcakes and I had to eat two pounds of it. Or right. just try and let us know. Yeah, let, it's let us know. very rich. See what we're dealing with. Yeah. Mm. Oh, that's incredible. It's good. It's good. It's good. Well, it, like, this, it tastes good, but it's not meant This kind of dessert is food. like, it's really heavy, so it's like a good small dessert. You're yeah. never supposed to eat too much of it. I guess that's why it's meant for 46 people. <laughs> everybody just gets a little It's true, because like, when you get baklava, they give you a little square. Yeah, so it's still, like, that's enough. baklava. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, and it's yeah baklava. baklava, you eat too much of a little bit. It's just, you don't it gets stuck in your teeth, yeah. it's chewy, but it's very good the way they made it. Yeah. Now imagine eating that entire cone right now. I ate a lot of that cone. I was just had a huge piece of it. I think we can do this. I think we can do this. <laughs> oh, oh, okay, Mr. Madison. I think we can do this. I'll, I'll give you 10 but, minutes. If you can get through this in 10 minutes, we'll ape this last part within the five. Was it the 30th participant in the Royal Rumble? <laughs> <laughs> the Royal Rumble of cake eating. Yeah. Here we go. I feel so oh. garbage right now. Yeah. Oh. Oh. It's weird, man. Like, no, it's like, yeah. tingling. Oh. All right, Eli, it's like, it's the sugar so shit. yeah, you can feel it. <laughs> yeah, the sugar. Eli, I'm stealing your spot right here. Go for it, man. Hi, this is Costa. I'm taking over. <laughs> <laughs> uh, they got 15 <laughs> minutes left playing Red Shot, so we'll see how they get through it. I'm not sure how much Eli's gonna contribute, but <laughs> <laughs> he's enjoying it. We're seeing how this goes before he can step step back. But I just want to say, like, all the components put together, even if it's such a mass quantity, everything comes together really well. Like, yeah, remember the ice yeah. cream, the cream, the sand, that baklava, it just, they thought of it really well. It's not just a food challenge. It's right. actually a quality, huge dish. Yeah. You know, that's why it's on the menu, and, yeah. you know, people can come in and share it. It's because, like, most food challenges we go to, like I said, with the burrito, they just want cheap food that, you know, they do just comp, whatever. But yeah. this one has, there's a lot of, like, quality, you know, they pre-make it, you know, there's a lot of time and effort into this. Great for weddings. <laughs> yes, yeah. Right. yeah. yeah. That would have been yeah. awesome yeah. for the wedding. I agree. Uh, I feel like this would be a dope wedding. Is this day. caterable? This sounds like pretty, awesome pretty. pretty... <laughs> oh wow. Yeah, we're going. And I think the price is really reasonable. Yeah. 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 All right, we have to get married again. <laughs> <laughs> renew the vows. Yeah, renew. Wow. Well, I mean, our wedding cake was a burger, though, so I can still. Your wedding cake was a burger cake? Yeah. Awesome. It was a burger cake, and we were like on top of it, and... <laughs> but wait, was it like an actual like big burger? Or did it just yeah, it was like, yeah, and my wife's into like a caving, you know, going into caves, so they had her like, they had a chunk cut out and it looked like a cavern, oh. and she was like propelling down it. <laughs> That's so really cool. Cute. I saw pictures of your wedding, it was adorable. It's it was a crazy like, yeah. yeah. It was a very unique wedding. It was the best wedding anybody's ever had, or ever will. Bold claim. Yeah. Fact. Bold claim. Wow, it's just like straight up wealthy, right? Tenacious D was there. That wins right alone. Who was your wedding? Well, they were at your wedding? Well, uh, Kyle was. We, we did a song with him, which was like, made my life. Oh, sorry. Thank you very much. That's <laughs> amazing. Yeah. Yeah. And she just asked who Tenacious D is, by the way. Uh, uh, she was also called this in, uh, <laughs> Napoleon. Napoleon for a while. But so. I don't, I'm, I'm to shelter. I'm sorry. It's all good. Yo, I'm. this is pretty much done. I'm like. I think we're there. Mm -hmm. I think we just covered this part. So when he wins, no. Eli's going to have to do all the work for you guys. <laughs> no, look, man. Eli's going to take the credit. Had to come in the fourth. Yeah. He's like, proof. Whoa, that's <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Would be could have covered your wedding. Who is that? Kyle Gass. Kyle Gass. Yeah, wheelbarrow of tacos. Wheelbarrow of tacos. Is that yours? His wedding. 
A wheelbarrow of tacos? Uh, a tortoise what? was the ring bearer. This shit provides sustenance. Adequate Whoa. sustenance. <laughs> We had, a, we had a dinosaur. Uh, we have course. a request to Fanbot. 500 bits if you each take one last bite. Okay, like I'll one just like a big bite. massive bite. Oh yeah, there's the cake. Oh god, I don't that's want to So it. that's an actual cake yeah. that's just shaped like a burger. Uh-huh. Oh, okay, one last bite, guys. Okay. Yeah, this yeah. is, um, I think we got to take a stronger. I think we're going to see me over here. I'm ready for my second Oh no, we can see you. Oh, okay. okay. You're chill. Oh, so there we go. No. Second win. I totally kind of want to, but I don't. Yo, I'm thinking about what you said about the buffet earlier when you like you eat dessert in between the yeah. courses. I realize that after I eat, I have my dessert and then I get hungry again. Yeah. And it's really weird. It's a change of taste. You have oh, savory and sweet much. and then you want savory again. Thank you so much. Yeah, now all I want is like something salty. Yeah. Mm. Quick. Salt. Lobster pot pie. No. <laughs> yeah. Lobster pot pie. Yeah, lobster pot pie. Yeah, what? Lobster! Lobster! lobster. <laughs> they seem to think we're kidding. We don't want lobster bucks. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'll pay for them with them, huh? You don't want it? How, are the lobster bucks, is everything on the menu meant for like group share, like family style? Um, I mean, it could be. A lot of people will get their own trays really and then end up sharing. Yeah. But, uh, but I mean, appetizer and all that stuff, yeah. Uh, all for sharing. But like, like the, the lobster pop charts, are those actually like big, like in the. They're a pop tart size. They oh. come in a toaster oh, oven. That's food tart. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. Again, Bart and G Not just to, like no. go in with the crazy no. presentations. No. That's tight. Yeah, so it's in the double digits. Yo, shout out yeah. for the new badge. What is Reminder: oh, you donate two hundred bits. <gasps> his four meals donate to the Bracken's kitchen. Yeah, they do some pretty good stuff. I mean, heck, it only looks like a quarter now. Come on, Kevin. Yeah, you guys have like a quarter of the cake left. That doesn't look that bad. We'll talk to them. How much time we have? All of a sudden, it looks possible again. Oh, what's yeah. the time? I, I took one bite and that round of cream. Minute? and yeah. nine and minutes out. left. Wanted, it's I hard to get restarted. Eight eight and we, we, we all heard it. <laughs> I heard it. <laughs> we all were thinking it, but he just didn't say anything. What? I feel like what I said. <laughs> oh, okay. Are there more? Did we eat all the cherries? I was going to say that's no, what right. she said, but she would oh. she would be the opposite. I was confused. You hear it in the video where you rewatch it now. You'll get it. Get it later. Okay. I don't know if I want to rewatch this one. Yeah. <laughs> the humiliation. I mean, yeah. this, this is like what, 20, 25 pounds of stuff? <clears throat> Sweets? Sugar's looks, hard. Looks yeah. Like and I put oh, yeah. at least four pounds of it down myself. I don't know. What <laughs> <doing>. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I could take on more of this in two minutes than you just took out in the past like 10. Come on. All right, here we go. Oh, new member. Oh, new member. Yeah. Oh. You win? New member. Forever the revival. I remember. <laughs> well, how did that go what, in, the, in the video game? Whenever you enter a quarter, here yeah. comes a new challenger. <laughs> <laughs> Change. There we go. Well, how, much did, how, much did, how, much did, how much did Eli take? Like, he that took little, like about that. Well, I ate a quarter of it. And then he took some of the crap. I ate a quarter of it. Yeah, yeah, so that's all oh, called. Like, crap, I have to go run to the meter. Oh. oh. I'm not eating it anyway. <laughs> I mean, hobble to the meter. Chef says if they go ham, that we'll bring out a popcorn shrimp. Wait, in a popcorn maker. Oh, guys, stay tuned to the end of the stream, and we are gonna see something are you guys pretty in? cool. Oh. I will eat some popcorn shrimp. Yeah. Let me go walk. You go ham on this. <laughs> <laughs> dun, dun, dun. You, gotta, you gotta give it a solid go. I'm gonna have to fire it. Eight. Yeah, eight. I, I'm done with the ice cream. Hashtag eight. Eight mode. We're just gonna sit here. You're gonna go for the popcorn shrimp. Yeah. Not too much, not too much, just, just to taste it. Something it's gonna similar. be the regular portion. Okay, good, okay. Yeah. good, good, that sounds good. Not like, not another Thank 25 pounds of popcorn. Regular portion, portion of the rest <laughs> are bigger. <laughs> yeah, I just want like a couple pieces of popcorn. Alright, so we have a special uh, dish coming out. We're gonna ask you to see one of the savory dishes that Barton G does. Yes, please. It's called the popcorn shrimp, but that's all we know. But it's not gonna be all you see. It's gonna be pretty cool. So, once this challenge is wrapped... I'm just gonna... Dun dun dun. Oh, this ice cream is so cold still. Oh, How is this still so cold? I don't know how the ice cream yeah, stays back in shape like that. That's what I was going to say a few minutes ago. Is that what's amazing to me is that it never really melts. Yeah. Like it keeps, it's that, still... keeps that same consistency, same temperature almost. Raina has passed all the way out, guys. Hey, she, yeah. she's, uh, <laughs> she might be asleep at this point. Yeah, you know, I've already eaten more than you. I don't think so. You know, mm -hmm. nope. if, if the ice cream melted, I think it would have. We would have had a real good job. Uh, they would have like soaked in everything. Yeah. They would have like it would have turned it, but yeah. I don't know how they. Oh. There's good magic. amount of graham crackers at the base. It's magic. Doesn't melt. 
Yeah. Sugar drunk? Whatever you want to call it. Oh, I'm going to go crazy soon. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> I can't say. Yeah. Rickshaw says he thinks there's an enzyme in it that makes it melt slower. Ah. Oh, Science. Science. Is that possible, Costa? It's possible. <laughs> I've never heard of this enzyme. Clement well, Rickshaw, tell us more about this enzyme. They do that for some popsicles, he said. Oh. 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 Like this, like an Oh, I don't know if that's in this, but I can see it for like the Walmart popsicles. For yeah. science. Or like the Walmart ice cream sandwiches that you put yes. out in the sun and never melt. Yes, I've seen those. So there's a Beyond Meat. Are they getting ready to come out with Beyond Dairy? <laughs> I think they're still working on just trying to like get the beef first, but I hear that Impossible Foods have been trying to do their own dairy. <laughs> There's some pretty good dairy alternatives out there, right? Already. Mm -hmm. So funny. I, I'm a happy drunk. Cheryl, <laughs> sugar drunk. Yo, Raina is sugar drunk, y'all. Ask her anything know, you like. Crazy. Food, food drunk is a real thing, guys. It is. They, she really is super drunk. She hasn't had a sip of alcohol. Oh, congrats to FanBot on the new bitch badge. Congrats. Oh. Upgrade achieved. I like that. Oh my goodness. Uh, I told you we're a human experiment. This is what happens. My body's very sensitive to chemical reactions, and this is what happens. All I see is Wilford Brimley in the corner, just <laughs> staring at me. <laughs> oh, should be the title of the video. What happens when somebody eats too much sugar? That is good. Let's start. Let's start. Ask us some questions so we can get that good content on the on the what tail What should be the YouTube. title of this video? Because, I mean, 25 pound ice cream scoop is overrated. We should just have something else to get, you know, that attention grabber. We got drunk off ice cream. Yes. Yes, man, man, it's left. There you go. You think you can watch Straight Line? I think we got five minutes. Eli didn't yeah, get three. drunk because he didn't. Three, three, three minutes, minutes left. Join you guys. Nice. <laughs> All right, well. Unless the human oh, time, is, time is up. Unless the no human more. cyclone no, shows up no and just more. runs through that. <laughs> He's paying for partner. Mm, because I have so many videos already, like. 11 pound, 10 pound, whatever. So 20 pound ice cream, whatever. 25 pound. Oh, 25 pound ice cream. Oh, that's four feet tall. Oh, four feet tall. Yeah, I guess. I like that though. We got jungle ice cream. Right on time. There we go. Yay, we're back. There we go. Yeah. Oh my God, Natter's a beast. Natter can eat so much. I think we're gonna have to call it a day. Yeah. Nice. Thank you. All right, Kevin guys, Ross walked away as it was. Yes. I think Kevin just died. I think he's paid for parking. <laughs> I, I know, I think he just left. He, he just, just drove like, off. We're just 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 off. And he's back. How we doing, Kev? There he is. Oh, Wobble. Hard to jaywalk with a boot and a belly full of cake. Uh oh. Boot. All right, guys. So you guys inspired us right when I got there. Wow, cool. Wow. Four competitive eaters not finish the oops I tried on my ice cream. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay, okay but I want to recent state that when you guys came to shoot with like 12 people, right? You only do one tenth, so that's yeah. just like in comparison to this. It's okay. been restated. Yeah. And I think yeah. you guys took out about <laughs> 17, 18 pounds on your own. I added like another two. Eli added like a quarter of a pound. Yeah, we did good, I think. Yeah. Quarter of a pound, Costa. I'm not. I'm not liking the disrespect. I put some damage. That's a put some damage on the right there. I put some damage on the ice cream, guys. We're gonna let the stream run a little bit because uh, we're gonna take oh, a look at some of the savory dishes that Barton G has. Ooh. We're all gonna get oh, a little bit savory. of Instagram love fun. Uh, so in the intro, go ahead and follow Barton G on Instagram, um, guys. How do, you, how do you guys feel about this? You're gonna do another sugar challenge anytime no, soon? No, no. I mean, this was special for you because I love you. So I came. I love you this. guys. Thank yeah, you. I appreciate but you. Ever since my last good. sugar challenge, like a couple months ago, I was like, no more sugar challenges. Oh yeah, we did one. The cookie. Was oh that, yeah, yeah, yeah. One? That's why I was so concerned about the sugar level. That's why I told you, could she put as least sugar as possible? Yeah. You know, no, because you know, like right I've done, I've done more than six pounds of food, up. but I know when you do sugar, it's literally like Different. double the oh. weight. Time's you know. Up. Oh, that's the time. Time is up. That was officially 60 minutes since we started. Yep. Damn. Y'all, that is impressive, though. The amount 
that that cone is down. I don't want to see the cone. This is like basically how much that's, that's left. Show how thick okay. it is. It's crazy. It is like really yeah. thick. Yeah. Hold up, I'm gonna peel a piece off and like hold it up to the camera so you can see like how many layers there There's are in like this. There's like 50 layers. The yeah. comments, the comment section on the Twitch stream are tend to be pretty pretty kind. Yeah, they, 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 they look like good. That's how many layers are in that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. could eat that by himself. You guys saw it. That's the nicest YouTube comment I've ever heard. You guys, you will kill yourself. Yeah, yeah, and then we get yeah. those too. YouTube. YouTube. Oh, oh, it's oh. finally melting. Come back to follow. <laughs> oh, there yeah, it goes. There it it's is. lost its integrity. Yeah. Yeah, it's just like, oh, no. It's giving it a little. Oh. Should we clear it for the, for the next thing? Oh, yeah. yeah, get it away. Get it. <laughs> clear presentation. All right, all right, guys, we're gonna clear the set a yeah, little bit, but we'll be right back. Anybody think we can go to the streaming soon? Thank, Thank you so you. much. Thank you. That was a. Oof. When's the next time you're gonna eat ice cream again? Uh, next summer. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, nice job, guys. Thanks for time as a kid's birthday party. Good job, friends. Yes. We did a good yeah. job. I think this wasn't a food challenge. It was a science experiment. Like, low mm -hmm. They really wanted that, like, low key. Oh, I just, had to, I just went to my um, card, but more money in the meter. Oh, okay. My meter's flexible. No, sorry, not that. I meant the meter, sorry. Oh, meter. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. I made it. It literally um, expired as I got there. Oh. You're nice. good. Maybe I, mine expired. I shouldn't. I actually, I actually kind of ran there on my hobbly foot. Oh shit! If yours expired, mine is minutes. definitely expired. Where, where is I'm it? I'm right in front of them. Is there a police car? If there's no police car in front of oh, that, they'll get you. They'll get you. It's LA. They'll get you. Yeah. Yeah. In fact, I, I probably am supposed to have actually moved my car because it's like yeah. a two-hour yep. thing. I should be nobody noticed. You know, if I put another. It says minutes. must. Where we park the meter. It says must move vehicles. Well, I did yeah. it, so hopefully they weren't paying attention. You know? Please, no yeah. parking ticket. I parked in that Melrose place. Uh, I love the parking lot. Yeah, yeah, that guy was really cool. He's like, if you make it here in two hours, it's free. If not, I'm keeping your 20. Really? <laughs> I tried to find the. I uh, was looking yeah. for that parking structure, but I couldn't find it. You gave if you, you, you gave it to yeah, me. Yeah, there was thing. I just couldn't see it. I just like. Yeah. I think I probably just right near it, but I can. Uh, yeah. I mean, one is like up the street that way, and then one is like it's down there, yeah. all the way down there on Melrose. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Okay. Oh, Presentation on boys right there. Wow. Turn around so I can. Oh, turn around. Can we do this show the audience yeah, real quick? Yeah, yeah. What do you got? Sauces for your dipping pleasure. Sweet dip dip chili sauce, spicy oh. mayo. Cool. That's cute. But this, buttery this, too. This, this is still a big portion compared to what I had in my head. Oh yeah. This is yeah. like, it's still a sharing thing. Isn't That's it. We're going to get one of these ice creams with popcorn Thank makers. so much. I lied. I said ice cream maker. <laughs> I just threw all ice cream machine. That's, that's cool. I hope we have one. I just never opened it. That's ice cream maker? Awesome. Yeah. Oh. We have oh, a lot of it from the wedding. We have, no, after the wedding. We have a lot of fancy things we haven't opened. Fondue machine? Never opened Ooh. it. Don't fall between the table thing. Oh. Fondue machine sounds Alright, guess so what we're looking at right oh! now is one of Barton It's okay. Oh, you savory dishes. This is their popcorn chicken, and it's served out of a retro popcorn machine. Just try this popcorn chicken. I mean, not popcorn. Yeah, popcorn shrimp, la. It's shrimp, dude. Oh, it's shrimp. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's popcorn shrimp. Oh, we're coming out of the popcorn chicken. machine. Wow. There we go. Mm. Mm. Oh. It's kind of hard with this thing on the light. Mm. Mm. What kind of camera? That is cute. It's good. That's just the glare. But if I was to go out today and buy a camera, what would you suggest? Uh, what would I suggest? Yeah, Ari Alexa, I guess. Okay. <laughs> yeah, like a two thousand dollar camera. Three thousand dollars. Like a fifty thousand dollar camera. <laughs> <laughs> you see how much I know about cameras. <laughs> get a, well, get, right, get like a Thank you so much for watching at home. Follow Barton G on Instagram. I'm gonna leave everyone's uh, handle. You guys can do it, and then see me on Food Beast Instagram as well, guys. And hey, we going live tomorrow again. We're going live tomorrow again. We're in the Food Beast kitchen every Friday. We're gonna be cooking with a giant leg of prosciutto. Oh, We're gonna be doing ooh. some fun things. With oh, they really so. used a popcorn maker to make the popcorn. Mm. Is it really? That's crazy. Yeah, the kernels are actually in there. We can try one of those. Are we trying? Yeah. Okay, there you go. It's actually is really refreshing after all the cake. Sacrilege. <laughs> all right. Yeah, Bye, guys. Great job today. Bye, Bob. Bye, everybody. Sorry, we're not better. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> try it yourself. All right, we out. <laughs> Good. Oh.
Whew. Mm. Nice job, oh, guys. Thank you for the help. You're welcome. Yeah, thanks for the help. How do you get to the popcorn, though? What do you do? I mean, what do you have to do? Like, uh-huh. I'll just you take a shrimp out. out that, yeah, you can pull that out. The boat. Oh, no. Oh. We There's lost more. The shrimp died for nothing. Shrimp too. Make it a few of those. We have some over here. I'm not going to eat them, but you would do it. I'm just dead. Oh, this makes my stomach feel better. Oh yeah, it's definitely something to coat the dairy. Like, there's no more dairy. The ice cream is getting really nasty. Mm-hmm. Do the lactate help, Kev? I don't know. I mean, it's hard to know without a time machine, but hopefully it'll help. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Mm-hmm. I would take some butter, too. Have you, have you tried um, the various fake shrimp products yet? Oh, I don't think they've okay. gotten there yet as far yeah, as the other No one's gotten good. Yeah. The closest is New Way Foods mm-hmm. over in the Bay Area. Can't even do an outro then, no problem. It's like fried <laughs> and crispy, but. Lord? I've, had, um, I've had fake squid that tastes okay, but that's just like regular squid. It tastes like chewy, no- chewy nothing in it. Mm-hmm. Check out everybody. Like and subscribe. I don't think they're See ever going to like um, make a fake like oyster or something that's impossible. Bye. Fake oyster would be crazy. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed it. And make sure to check out my website for all my merchandise. I've got clothing, prints, and stickers all up on there. And make sure to check out my social media, my Facebook page. Um, I do a lot of live streaming and on my Instagram page. I do a lot of giveaways and on my Twitter page. I also give a shout out to where I might be so you guys can kind of follow me on my journey, okay? And then check out my other videos. And again, make sure you subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, guys. See you next time. Bye-bye.